What is going on boys and girls, welcome back to a brand new video. This is the Bloons Tower Defense map as part of the Noah J456 map competition. And I currently don't have a gun, but do I have a knife? Yes, I do. Hello my friend, and goodbye. Headshot! Okay, that actually worked. I don't see any perk bottles there, so how do I exactly take this? Oh, okay, I, um, I ate a banana. We're also going to be doing the Easter egg, which I'm really looking forward to doing, because apparently at the end you get a really cool custom wonder weapon. Oof! 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 Why is she not dying? She's dead. Wait, I can melee with this! That's cool. I like that. I have a feeling that this is something to do with the Easter egg. You are not ready yet. Um, I think I might be, mate. This map is really bright. It's actually that bright. I've had to turn my colour correction off on OBS. This is what it looks like with my colour correction on OBS. Stay away from me, please. I'm a nice guy. Please leave me alone. I'm just trying to make YouTube videos and have fun. I've upgraded it and now it fires really fast. So for the Easter egg, there's six weapons around the map. Oh, there's four weapons. It's one or the other. And what you have to do is fully upgrade them by... I think you go back to there to fully upgrade it. And once it's fully upgraded, you essentially sacrifice it to this. Which there is three of around the map. And I don't know what happens from there. I've died again! No! Hey, yo, what? Is that what it's like when it's fully upgraded? That is mad. Yeah, I need to get out of here. This is getting a bit... A little bit hectic. I can't lie. Just for reference, I've played Bloons Tower Defense a whole three times probably when I was at school. A kaboom. Uh, I can't get it right now because I need to kill these guys. Okay, they're dead. No, don't leave. Yes, okay, I got it. How much is it to upgrade this? I'm sure it said 3,500, right? Yo, what's this? Can I open this door or am I just stuck here? No, I can open it. Okay, that's cool. That is insane. Okay, hold up. Let me see if I can get a lot of them rounded up and take them out with one shot. Come on, guys. Come on. Boom! 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 That is mad. That is so cool. Headshot. Why did that not count as a headshot? This will. Three, two, bang. That is amazing. So now I've got a boomerang gun, which, yeah, it looks quite cool, actually. Let's see what it does. Does it go through them or does it just bounce off them? I think it goes... Yeah, it goes through them, I think. Say hello to my little friend. So I've upgraded this three times. I've upgraded this twice right now. I need to get six upgrades on both of them and then one more weapon to even start doing the Easter egg. And that's before I've even opened up all the map to be able to access all three of those totems right there. Wait, I can use this as a melee weapon. This is sick. Boom and kaboom. See you later, boy. I still can't believe how bright this map is because, listen, okay, I know I've already said it. I'm super colorblind and this map's really bright for me. Like, extremely bright. Dude, I'm wearing sunglasses. Karate chop! I've got a story for you guys as well. So, I was at work yesterday at the time of recording this anyway. And I was making some drinks. I'm a bartender. If you've not watched my previous videos, I do mention it in those. And this woman comes up to the bar and it was a white wine spritzer, which is a small white wine. It's a small house white wine and soda, unless you want lemonade. But you've got to specify because it by default is soda and not lemonade. If you tell me you want lemonade in it instead, cool, I'll do it with lemonade. It's literally not a problem at all. But this woman didn't say that. And she's drinking away and drinking away. And she gets about halfway down this drink and comes up to the bar. And I'm really busy. Give me the banana. And she comes up to the bar, and I just say, hi, yeah, what's up? What can I get for you? Is everything all right with your drink? Just typical stuff bartenders say, because we're all robots and say the same thing. And she says, and I quote, this drink is absolutely disgusting. What is it? Another part, let's go. Juggernaut as well. Yeah, man. Okay, I don't feel like I'm going to get killed instantly now. Do I put these on there? I need another part, I think, but I don't know what it looks like. Hello, sun god. How are you doing, my friend? Oh, I'm getting hit by zombies. But yeah, so I just say to this woman, Oh, okay, sorry about that. Can I get you something else? And then she proceeds to say, Did you put soda in this drink? To which I say, yes. And I explain to her, that's how it comes default, unless you specify it. Otherwise, you can have lemonade in it. Whatever you want, really, to be fair. But it's not a spritz, so if you have anything else, other than those two, pretty much. So she says, I didn't ask for this with soda in it, and it's absolutely vile. Can I have lemonade in it instead? So I say, yeah. And for some weird reason, this 40-year-old woman that's probably drank a lot of spritzers in her life, no offence if you even know who I am right now, didn't realise it came with soda by default. And to that I say, you are an idiot. And to anybody else that goes to bars drinking and things like that, I don't because I'm sick of seeing alcohol. When it looks like I've got 101 things to do, the chances are I have 102 things to do. So please just cut me some slack if I'm really busy because if it's only me on the bar and it's going down then I need to focus and get these drinks out or people are going to start crying. <laughs> he just took his legs off. 
I'm just trying to figure out where the totems are. So there's one down there. I know for a fact there's one up there. But can I get through here? Yes, I can. See, I told you there was one up here. Mule kick. This is literally the best camping spot of all time. No, it's not. This ball behind me, apparently. Are they climbing up the ladder? Yeah, they are. Okay, so there's a totem over there. I don't know if you can see it. It's literally there. We've got one here, and then there's one right there. We know where all three of them are now. Now it's just a case of upgrading guns and getting all this cool stuff. To the guy in my videos that says I trash mule kick all the time, which I do, I'm not lying. I'm not denying that fact by any means. I bet you that I would get mule kick when I next see it, and I've seen it, so just for you, my friend, I'm gonna buy it. My soul does now feel like it's been ripped out of its body, but it's okay. How much is this? Yeah, I'm gonna get this for my next weapon. The Sniper Monkey Path. That is pretty cool. I have no ammo on this. I've got ammo on that. If only I had a third gun, which will be you. Deep down, I really hope there's not a perk limit. If there is, and I've just wasted a spot on Mule Kick, I'm gonna cry. I wanna try and get one so it's bouncing off of here constantly. No, that didn't work. Oof, oof. Try the Sniper out, shall we? Let's see what it does. This looks cool. Can I scope in? I can. This is completely custom. I love this. This is awesome. It's literally now just a case of saving points and getting everything and upgrading everything pretty much. How do I get down from here? There's no way I can just jump. I'll die, right? Press E to link the motor systems. Yes, please. Whoa. Oh, it's a teleporter. Nice. So that's how I don't die. How much is it to upgrade this? 7,500. Okay, let's, let's crack on, shall we? We've only got two more upgrades on this, and I'm going to sacrifice it to this totem right here. This is so fun, man. Oh, my gosh. It just keeps bouncing off and just destroying them. Does this count as a headshot? Yeah, it does. I want to bounce one off of here and hit one of them. Oh, he took his legs off. That was incredible. Yo, my boy's got monkey arms. This is crazy. Wait, I'm playing as a monkey. Why have I only just realized I'm playing as a monkey? It feels like I've not recorded a video in ages because I've recorded so many videos in advance. I think I recorded like three or four in advance. This gun is terrible. How did I miss every single one of those shots when they were in a massive group? Let's upgrade it. What's it called again? Is it called the Juggernaut? Apparently so. Whoa, this, yeah, this is the Juggernaut, all right. So now I can offer the weapon there. So does it turn this into a soul box? No, it doesn't do it yet. I've got to do it for every single one. But now I've got to save up for Juggernaut again and Mule Kick, unfortunately. I'm not going to lie, I really don't want to do that. No offense. The Bionic Boomer. Now that is a cool name, but I need Juggernaut. How have I not got this yet? Is there another part up there or something? I need to stop playing like a bot because I'm usually really good at zombies and I'm playing like a complete trash can right now. Yo, they're jumping off of there. Okay, then. Um, Yeah, how have you still got your ankles, bro? Oh, no, don't kill me. What if I bounce them off of here? Does it still hit them? Uh, apparently not. This is so satisfying just hitting them with this. Oof. Yeah, that was super satisfying. I can't even lie. Let's upgrade this to the Bionic Boomer. I think it's called if I remember right. Whoa, what is this? It's turned fully automatic. Nice, that is cool. I feel so rusty right now. It's ridiculous. I've not played zombies, to be fair, in about, like, probably nearly a week. So, I have excuses that are valid, okay? Before you all roast me. Because I've gone down twice, I think. Yeah, I've gone down twice. That's embarrassing. Link that motor as well. That's the other totem. And we've got stamina up. That's cool. I like stamina up. I'm trying to reduce the amount of perks I get, though, because I just want to upgrade all this stuff and get down to business with the Easter egg. I would rather just keep upgrading the weapons and keep Jug and Quick Revive, to be completely honest. Turbo Charge. It's the exact same. I'm going to presume it's faster. Yeah, that's a lot faster. Oh, my God. Where is the other part for this? It's got to be up here or on there. It's literally got to be. Off a weapon. Okay, then. So, now I've only got one more totem, and I'm going to upgrade this. Is one of the parts in here use motor? Where does this take me? Oh, it takes me back up. Okay, I thought I could only go from here to the spawn. Widow's Wine. I love me a bit of Widow's Wine. Let's see what else is here. There's a weapon there. There's... Okay, there's loads of zombies, apparently. Lovely. I need to get down from here right now, or I'm going to die. I also need to upgrade this, so I might just camp here, to be honest, and see how long I last before I inevitably go down again. Double points, yes, please. Thank the Lord. Let's go. I've got to be able to upgrade it now, right? Yes! Get in. No! Oh, man, I hate myself. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. Oh, there's two of them. Did I just get two kabooms? Also, people in my comment section have been roasting me because I call them kabooms and not nukes or whatever they actually are. Leave me alone, okay? <laughs> this is more like it, boys. This is a lot better. The way it was firing before, I just... Yeah, I was gonna die. Where's the other part for this? I thought that was it for a sec. That's a zombie's hand. 
So we need 8,000 points, of which I need all of the actual 8,000 because I've got barely 300 points to upgrade it. And then we can offer it to the one down there where... St ah, okay then. Where stamina up is, and then we can use them as soul boxes because that's what they turn into when you sacrifice your guns. And we can do the rest of the Easter egg. Let's go. When did that appear? We're pretty much halfway to 3... Th not 3,000. God damn it. I said that because I looked at my money. To 8,000 to fully upgrade this thing. How many more zombies did we have left? Were there a few? Yeah, I should have just kept them, to be honest with you. That looks like a really sad image of my boy just burning down there. So what other perks do we have? We've got Stamina Up. We've got Juggernaut. We've got Quick Revive. We've got Widow's Wine. We've got Mule Kick, which I've already got. I'm not getting it again, okay? So for the guy that's watching this that begs me to get Quick Revive all the time, I got it for you once, and I think once is enough. Okay, my friend? Full Auto Rifle. These are really basic names, but I'll take it. Has the reticle changed colour, or is that just me being stupid? Whoa! Wait, hang on a minute! Okay, then, this is insane. I don't want to get rid of this gun. I love this gun. So let's use the motor, go back down to spawn, and run over here. But I've linked this one, so where does that take me? Does it take me back there? I actually can't get over this gun. It's so good. I don't even need to ADS with it, either. Wait, I'm not going to have another gun if I sacrifice this. I'm sad to see you go, my friend. I really am. I'm sad to see you go. What is this? I hope it's good. Yeah, that's good. Okay, I'll take it. I think I just found the last part for this thing right here, which is... I don't know what it's called, but I know it's a trap. Activate it for a thousand. Yes, please. I'm keeping you right there. Do I get points when you kill someone? Yes, I do. I need to do the soul boxes, though, so please spawn over here. So now that I've offered three fully upgraded guns to each one of the totems... They essentially turn into soul boxes, and I need to fill each and every single one of them, regardless of the trash weapon that I've got. Oh man, there's so many zombies right now, this is insane. This is killing nobody, I'm stuck! No! Dude, I've gone down three times now, this is ridiculous. I need to sprint really fast. I'm dead, I'm so dead right now. No, I'm not, no, I'm not. Oh, look at me being a top G, let's go. Come on. Wait, let me go down here. Wait, I can't bite it. Oh no, this is not good. For the first time ever, I feel a little bit nervous. If I think this saw box is bad, I've got to do the one at spawn. Kill them all, please. Don't kill me. There's insta-kill. I need that right now. Please don't touch me. I'm a nice guy, please. I'm just a regular civilian, okay? Get over here, zombies. I'm going to kill every single one of you right now. Okay, this one is completed. Let's go. And now we're going to do the one at spawn, which I wish I would have done first now, to be completely honest. I really want to click this, but I also don't know what it does, so I'm not going to do it. I didn't know I had two motors. Oh, yeah, one for that side and one for that side. Sorry, guys, I'm a little bit autistic. I don't know if you knew that already. How many souls do you need, man? How many souls? Also, another thing that I should have pointed out, whichever weapon you choose to offer to these things, it then becomes locked, so I can't actually get this gun again. I can't get that gun again, I don't think. Did I use sacrifice this weapon? Yeah, apparently I did, and I can't get the sniper anymore, which was my favorite gun. So now I've got to use this. So to be honest, there's no real point in using Mule Kick because there's probably about two weapons left available for me. Oh man, oh no. I just need to remember I can't get Quick Revive, so I literally cannot go down. How many more souls do you need, bro? Like, honestly. Come on, god damn it. Okay, it's done, it's done, it's done. Thank the Lord. Where's the next one? The next one's on top of the tower. Oh no. Hey bro, I think you missed the target a little bit. Let me just round up some perks before it absolutely goes insane. Okay, guys, just cut me some slack. I'm so sad that this weapon is locked. This is genuinely one of the best weapons in the map. I had a lot of fun with it once it was fully upgraded. And attack! So once I've done this last soul box, apparently I have access to go up there and I can get a secret wonder weapon or something like that. And then I get to shoot this and then this laser hits that, I think. And then you have the option for a viable ending, which I am going to do, provided I don't die. Because I'm not going to lie, recently I've been on a track record with these challenges. Because I went through a phase of two or three videos of failing the challenge back to back, and it was making me severely depressed. Wait, what is happening right now? Zombies, just can you stop a sec, please? I'm just trying to focus on what's happening for the story. So now I can go up there. Nice one. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Also, that doesn't shoot that. I've got to shoot that with the wonder weapon. Hang on a minute. I think I've just seen something important. Oh, it's back. It's back. Attack. Oh, wow, I missed you, bro. Hi, I've missed you. The last zombie. I'm going to keep you for a minute, actually. Genuinely, I thought this map wasn't going to be that good, and this is one of the best maps I've played. It deserves the top spot on Steam, which is where it still sits to this day. 
This is a lot of steps. My little legs in real life would be dead. Probably about there. Receive the Apex Plasma Master. Yes, please. Whoa, what is that? Q and mouse four. Let's blast this thing. Oh, this is mad. What is happening right now? This is... Wow, this is insane. What is this? What? This is mad. Eatical help for endgame. Not yet, not yet. Let me just have a little bit more fun. If I die now, I'm really sorry. Let's just activate everything, man. Why not? Let's do it. Let's just do it. Let's do it for the memes. Kill them all. Any more? There you are. There's one there. Insta kill is there. This is a madness. And let's get the kaboom. I'm breaking my golden rule. Guys, I am so sorry I broke my golden rule. But we have completed the map. Let's freaking go. I had so much fun. We locked onto your location. I'm sorry. Wait, have you just killed me? Oh, wow. You've actually just killed me. I can't believe that's happened. 